Hello, my name is Cornelius Kölbel and I'd like to show you a new feature of Privacy Idea 2.9. This new feature is the questionnaire token. The questionnaire token lets you define a set of questions which the user needs to answer. First, let's log in as administrator. Okay, the questionnaire token is a new token type, which means this token type can be configured. The administrator can define a set of questions. He can define as many questions as he likes to. And he can define how many of these questions the user needs to answer during the enrollment process. Okay, so let's log in as a user and enroll such a token. First, we log in as the user with our, with our um, Active Directory password. The user enrolls a token. Due to a policy, he's only allowed to enroll the questionnaire token, just for simplicity at this moment. Here we see the questions which the user, uh, which the administrator has defined, and we start answering these questions. Finally, we also set a token pin. When we take a look at this token, we see that the answers to the questions are encrypted in the database so that the database admin cannot see the answers. Now we log out, log in as administrator again, because I want to show you how authentication works. Therefore, I enable the policy so that users should authenticate against privacy idea when logging in to the web UI. I log out again and the user Hans cannot log in with his Active Directory password anymore, but he needs to log in with a token and authenticate against privacy idea. So first he provides his OTP pin and he will start a challenge response authentication. You see authentication is not complete. We are asked one of the questions which we have previously answered. What is the name of my pet? It's cat and I'm logged in. And each time the user Hans tries to authenticate, he will get another question which only he knows how to answer. So this is the questionnaire token. You can use it to for different concepts like enrollment, registration, or a backup token. I hope you liked it. Stay tuned and thank you for watching.